the fall of 2011, on the hot and dusty plains of West Texas and the Texas Panhandle, Great Southwestern Construction began work on the Cross Texas Transmission Line project, a $217 million job that will be the largest in Great Southwestern's 36-year history and among the largest for MYR Group. CTT is a major project. It's part of the Competitive Renewable Energy Zone, uh, which is in West Texas which is a string of transmission line infrastructure projects being built out throughout West Texas to deliver wind energy to East Texas and then the possibility to sell it to other markets around the country. The project involved 235 miles of double circuit 345 kV transmission line and 1,400 structures that included both lattice and monopole steel towers ranging from 140 to 200 feet tall. It's a big job, all the way around from uh, the, the size of the project, from a, from a contract standpoint. Large monopoles and large lattice structures here. It's a big wire. Great Southwestern was the prime constructor, responsible for most of the material procurement and all right-of-way construction, as well as foundations, structure and wire installation, and restoration. Of course, this massive undertaking presented a hefty set of challenges. Well, Texas throws a little bit of everything at you. We've been from real windy, sheer flat, to we're trying to get in the canyons now. You got wildlife to contend with too, and we got scorpions, spiders, black widows, rattlesnakes, wild hogs. Yet the crews of Great Southwestern faced each and every test with a strong spirit of teamwork and camaraderie. You know, they're like family. They, they move from job to job for extended periods of time. So there's that real solid level of comfort within the crew and, and knowing each other's ability, I think from the safety standpoint, the ability to perform work well. In July 2013, Great Southwestern completed the CTT project on schedule and well within budget. The new line will help to bring clean, renewable energy to millions of homes and businesses throughout the Lone Star State. It's a good project that will help the reliability of uh, Texas infrastructure for many years to come. <laughs>